Hello, everybody, and welcome to part 16 of The Evil Within. Now, before we, uh, start, I just want to take a small moment to be weirdly sentimental. Uh, this, uh, the one that I'm recording right now, and I, I'll be putting it up, uh, on YouTube af the, immediately after I finish recording, or broadcasting, uh, which may, which means if in the next like 20, 45 minutes, however long this episode is, uh, if somebody puts up a video, which is impossible, I'll go ahead and say, uh, then this will be Sentient Blender Productions' 50th video. Um, now that doesn't really seem like a whole lot, seeing as you know how often we put videos up, but, um. For a long time, uh, it was pretty... We, we, we didn't really know if we wanted to do this or if it was going to work. We didn't really know what we were doing. We still, <laughs> we still don't know. Um, but uh, for the very few people, admittedly, who, uh, who have been watching us uh, since the beginning, um, thank you. You guys are a little crazy. Um, <laughs> but, uh, we can't thank you enough, and for those of you, uh, who are just picking us up now, or are going back to watch our old videos, you know, sometime in the crazy robot future, um, I would like to apologize ahead of time. Uh, cause it doesn't get much better than this. Or, yeah. <laughs> Me talking at someone. So, um... Yeah, that's... that's really all I wanted to say. Um... Even though we really don't know what we're doing, um... We are very excited to see where this is going to go. Um... Now, I think that's enough me being sentimental. Let's... let's jump into it. Woo! Okay. <laughs> I can't be excited! Because... You know, after chapter 10, uh, I just can't, <laughs> I just can't get excited. I'm like, oh god, no, not you. I will, I don't, no, I, I don't really know what I'd do. I'll, I'll cry, I'll probably break down if I see that son of a bitch again. Physics. Okay, I don't want to be a complete asshole, but Christopher Reeves fell off a horse and was paralyzed for life. I just fell down an elevator shaft and I coughed a couple of times, and now I'm holding my side like, oh, this sucks. Way to, uh, way to be sensitive, Austin. That was... Right. Actually, you know what? Why can't all of... Oh, no, 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 no water, th no water, please. Wait, I can swim? There's a swimming mechanic in this game? Oh, no, it's over. All right. Because none of this is real. Jesus, you're a detective. Get with it. I believe this is uh, right here. This scenic overlook is what's known as a Kodak moment. Let me, uh, let me just get my, uh, my camera here. <laughs> yep. I just did that. Should I be doing anything special? I don't even know. Seeing how this is our 50th episode, spectacular! Woo! 
My brother will be disappointed. My... I guess I can tell you guys, it's not like it's a big secret or anything. Uh, one, or, uh, a one or maybe two, I don't, it depends on what footage we use, um, of our pre-recorded episodes that we're working on. Uh, one of them is uh, with my brother, because fuck it. We're, we're together. That doesn't happen often. Can I jump on this? No. I am prepared to shoot anything that jumps out of this water at me. I am dangerous when I am scared. Again. Let's poke him. Gah. Oh, cool. Alright. Don't... <laughs> Can you tell that I haven't played this before? It's really noticeable when I'm playing Marco Polo with dead bodies. Like, I wonder what's in here? Oh, man. Man. I mean, this place is essentially, like, what, New York? I've been to New York a couple of times. Uh... And I actually can't imagine... I bet it's I bet it's easier to find parking the way it is now. Even the way it is. I need to stop. I need to stop being surprised. I sound so sissy. I so <laughs> I really do sound like a sissy. But I'm like, Oh. No wonder she was such a <clears throat> testy individual. She's an actress. I wonder if we wait here long enough, we'll see the Ninja Turtles. fog started rolling in, and I was like, hmm. <laughs> Five stars. Is that a play on the mist? Maybe Silent Hill, perhaps? Oh, no, this is the, this right here is the ring. Maybe. I have not seen the ring. I do not like scary movies. Which is weird, like, I love, I love scary games, I love scary books, if there really even is such a thing. Uh, one of my favorite authors is Edgar Allan Poe. I know, to most people, he, it, that's going up, right? I'm not falling. Okay. Uh, I know to most people, like, The Raven, or The Telltale Heart, uh, just to name his, you know, more famous... Go, Jesus! Well, that's what happens when Otto gets Blotto. Well, there's... There's there's a reference not a whole lot of people will get. I think it, that's okay. No, I, I stopped watching The Simpsons in uh, in the early 2000s. But, uh, that was, that, was, that was still a Simpsons quote, so it's funny. Do -do -do. This is cool. Very atmospheric. I actually kind of like this. Why can't all of the game be like this? Well, I guess that was... I guess that was Resident Evil 4. Or most of the first half of Resident Evil 4. Was walking around like this. <laughs> no! Actually, do you know what this reminds me of? I just asked a question to no one. Man. <laughs> this reminds me of the Dead City level in, uh, in Metro. I love Metro. Ooh! <gasps> the 
the 44 Magnum, the most powerful handgun in the world. It'll blow your head clean off with one shot. Let's use it. I'm using it. What does the plus mean? Oh, that just means it was a new gun. Cool. See, I don't even know what Clint Eastwood was talking about. Now I'm feeling lucky. Punk? Niagara Falls, 2005. Is that significant? I don't think that is significant. Hey, you there! Which way to the beacon? Oh, damn, asshole. Stop, citizen! Ooh, shall we make topical jokes? No, no, no. Shall we make controversial topical jokes? Like Sebastian Castellanos is a detective, and detectives are police officers. Mmm. Wow. I... Mm. I'm, I, I already feel uncomfortable making this joke. It doesn't even really feel like a joke. Good. I'm walking here. Whew. Should I say, mmm? I'm having like a little, like, do you know, uh, low sequences, sequences in like movies or television where, uh, there's like a little angel and a little devil sitting on a guy's shoulder? I've got that. The devil's like, make the joke. Make the joke. It'll be funny. It'll be funny. Do it. Do it now. And the angel's like, don't be a dick. What you're about to say, that's what dicks say. Mm. Mm. I'm doing it. Sebastian Castellanos is, uh, is a detective. Uh, there must be a button here for choking. <laughs> Zing! Zing! Oh no, they're pissed. I'm sorry. Maybe you have one of these. Good. Ow, oh, you son of a bitch. Die, die! Thank you for your service, but die! Alright, I still have faith in you, Magnum. Even though, uh... You were less than ineffective against that guy. Holy shit, is that an alive person? Or just a zombie with an interestingly normal complexion. Yeah. Fuck off. I'm busy. Oh, that was the way to go. No. Oh, wait, no. Hip and hip. Is he completely naked? The entire city is self-destructing. I'm gonna throw this book. I'm gonna throw the book at this guy for indecent exposure. Boom! Oh, he's quick. Eh. Nice to know that I'm getting all kinds of we uh, ammo for weapons that I only use in emergency situations. But uh, ammo for my normal guns can't be bothered. Mm, I guess I'm gonna have to use this. Stop. Ah. I 
can't waste the ammo, so I'm gonna have to light you on fire. Do you find me sadistic? You will actually find that I am at my most frugal. Yeah. That's a super reference. You think, oh wow, is he making a Kill Bill reference? No, he's fucking up a Kill Bill reference. Ah. Thank you. Anything over there I can use? No. Whoop! Watch that first step! It's a doozy. Oh man, the movie references are flying! Watch that first step. It's a doozy. Oh man, the movie references are flying! If you're watching this with a friend and they don't understand that joke, please explain it to them. Hello? Oh. Land shark. I might have already done that. See, at the risk of being immediately, uh, <laughs> like, refuted by an insane boss battle, this is exactly what I was hoping that, uh, Chapter 11 would be. Is this? No. Oh. Oh. The alarm went off and Harvey Dent showed up. That's nice. And... Yep. Anyway, th this is exactly what I was hoping Chapter 11 would be like. Uh, you know, still the game, but a uh, much easier to talk during version. Hiya! Let's have some of this, maybe a little of that. Old fashioned key. Ooh. All right. Here's my little, uh... Here's my pro tip for a... Oh my god! For, uh, for beating the evil of that. Apply bullets, rinse, lather, repeat. When in doubt, let's try the magnum. Oh god. I can't see anything. <clears throat> well then. Okay, now I've had this theory for a while. That lady, or that girl that I think was her, his sister or like very close friend, I think that who died in the barn fire, that is the, uh, the, the, the girl with the crazy arms that's killed me an embarrassing number of times. Wait, can I... Yeah! That's awesome. Now I'm really in the black for bullets. That's good. Now I can spread the wealth. Yep. Maybe a little bit of... Yep. Come on. No? Hmm. Oh, wow. Wow, that was awful. That's actually the first thing that I've done to this game that I actually feel a little bad about. Like, oh, I blew his head up real good. That's what I like to see. <laughs> I 
I'm growing I'm growing very attached to uh to this gun. What shall I call you? I think this gun and I have become good friends. Let's give it a name. How about Exhibit A? Oh, I actually like that. Damn it. Damn it. Yeah. Good, good. Head inspector. Ah, shit. I'm gonna have to find you for that. When in doubt, Looney Tunes. And then... Yeah, okay, good, good. Oh, damn. You are the most dangerous one right now. Anybody else? I'm... I'm making donations to the pain bank! No, Austin, we talked about this. We all... <laughs> Remember what happened during Alien Isolation? You can't do one-liners. And... Whoa. <laughs> this one knows karate. Yeah, he, uh, he tried to he tried to try to falcon kick on me. No, trust me, I think I know what I'm doing. Haha, -ha, surprise grenade. They made me look good at this game. That's weird. I was kind of hoping to take his machine gun for mine own. Oh god. Right. We're still on the clock. God damn it. Fuck. It's like it's like zombie die hard. Come on, and fire fire. Oh wait, no, are they just dead? Okay. The Magnum's a one hit kill. That's all kinds of sweet. Should I use that? No, no, no. We can we can still do this. Yeah. Now 
can I take your gun? I'd like it very much, please. Wait, I just put one in his chest and he died. Oh god, was that a real person? Have I killed a man? I might have to turn in my badge, but that's okay. If my knowledge of uh, 80s and 90s action movies has taught me anything, it's that police officers do their best work once they've turned in their badge and gun. And boom. Would you like to try again? Oh shit. I was hoping to use less magnum ammo. But, hell man, when you need it, you need it. Ah, oh, this must be what I needed the keys for. Perfect. <sighs> you know what, I, uh... There is something, like, weirdly soothing about this. Because I walk around the... A city, um, a lot. And, uh, it's a lot of fun. I love doing it. Uh, I love, you know, my friends and I, uh... We've been doing it for a long time. It's one of our favorite things. And, uh, there's something, like, weirdly, like, peaceful and therapeutic about just walking down city streets for me. Ah. Ah. Let's go up first. Ah. Good, good. Alright, that was it. Maybe now we can stop by the... Mm, wait, no. <laughs> can't make a... Can't say that. I... I can't... <laughs> Whenever I almost tell people where I'm from, I, I just imagine, like, a bunch of people... <laughs> like, with little scorecards at home, just, like, crossing off areas of the United States where I couldn't live in. Like, earlier when I was talking about, like, when I visited New York, I'm like, oh, they're like, oh, shit, he doesn't live in New York. Cross out New York. I don't know. I have nothing against people knowing where I live. I'm just like, I don't know. It's the internet. And as a resident of the internet, I don't really feel like anybody should know. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> okay, now... I don't really say this very often, but oh my god! Okay. Now I have even more cause to say it. This place is completely fucked. Like, I have I know I've said that a lot of other times. Probably a lot of people say it a lot. Ooh. I think I can... That's a key thing. Can I... Can I push this to a place where I, I can... Have I already fucked this up? I think I fucked it up. Eh. G mm. Whoa! Oh god! That scared me a little bit. Ooh, I don't like this. Get out of the water, please. Okay, good. Ah! Fuck! 
Okay. Okay. Okay, the, the second I saw water at the beginning of this episode, and I was swimming for a little bit, I was like, shit, are there gonna be, like, monster fish, or, like... Fuck. Okay, now... Let's try... Okay. No, I, I'm just gonna have to go for it. Mmm. 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 No! Oh, I hate this! Ugh. <sighs> For those of you who do not know, I fucking hate the water. Which is weird, because for some reason, I... I'm a, uh, a certified scuba diver. I don't do it. Wait, can I just shoot him like this and he falls? Yes. Feast on the construction worker. He does construction. Let me up. Let me up. Gah. Fuck. This is really... This is actually for real, really shitty. Gah, no! Please, no! <laughs> After this episode, I am writing a strongly worded email to Shinji Mikami. He tastes better than me, probably. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna hold forward and not look at it. Uh, uh, am I good? We're good. Haha, -ha, yeah! You see these right here? These are called legs. That makes me immediately better than you. That's how I take solace in the fact that I'm a pussy when it comes to water. Inter I am evolutionarily... I sure don't want to go back to evol water anytime soon. Thank you. Finally. Evolutionarily? Evolutionarily? Or genetically m superior to all fish? <laughs> all fins are just shitty legs. God, I hated that. Wow! Okay. Can we fight someone I'm more comfortable with? Like, I don't know, Satan? No. No. The sonar... I killed you. I'm gonna pull, like, the 80s cliche. I killed you. I watched you die. Oh, that would be amazing. If this game was, like, was just like Roadhouse. <laughs> To me, Roadhouse is like the quintessential 80s movie. There is nothing more 80s. Like, you could be, you could have like a mullet and, not now, I'm talking. There could be, there could be. God, no! What do I do?
fuck? I guess we're just fighting. Oh, there's a lot of you. All right, these five shouts, these five shots have got to, these five shouts. Who's wrong? Da! They've got to count. Oh. Some kind of fake. Got that on film. You're the best. Around, nothing's gonna ever bring you down. Anyway, <laughs> if there was just a, if there was like a competition for who could be more 80s, there could be like a guy or like a woman who comes in with like a huge mullet, like bright, like Miami Vice colored clothes, leg warmers in the lot, and they like singing, I don't know, like 80s anthems, like Duran Duran shit. And uh, a man, a guy could just come in and plop Roadhouse, like a DV or a VHS of Roadhouse, down on the table and instantly be declared the vi the victor. That is how 80s Roadhouse is. Now, I don't know. I don't really know if there's a whoa. I don't really know if there's like a huge like Roadhouse fan base out there, but I'm I'm pretty sure I'm pretty sure I'm okay when I say that watching Roadhouse is pretty much good for a laugh and nothing else at this point. But it's re it's a fun move. Okay. This might be awkward, but I think I'm gonna have a word with our candy striper friend. Detective. Are you all yeah. Right? You do realize there would be no one to replace me. Okay, now just take a seat. We we need to talk. I know you you're a very good secretary. I mean you're you're paid well. No one can replace you, I know. But Unless we have a spectral janitor that I'm not aware of, you really should clean up the place. Maybe just, just, just sweep every now and again. Really, I mean that that would be, that'd be more than enough. Okay, fine. <sighs> That is, ooh. Nothing bites more than the silent treatment. Ugh. God. I think, well, nothing, nothing hurts me more than the silent treatment. I think it's because the silent treatment is so juvenile that the person must have to be, like, crazy mad at you to, uh, to, <laughs> to actually do it. Oh, you actually can't do it quickly. You have, you have to actually wait until Sebastian is finished being shocked to actually hit the next thing. Let's go with this. Mm. Yeah. We're we're do we're employing a lot more violence uh, now in terms of boss battles, so I think just having our guns do more damage will probably probably be for the best. All right, I'm sorry. I didn't. Damn it! <laughs> you work really hard. I know you do. I I probably have a lot of issues, man. You're. No, we gotta be. We have to take a hard stance. If I come back here and there's shit all over the floor, we're docking your ghost salary.
wrong but there we go yeah I have a feeling that ammo for the Magnum is going to be very rare no you don't know what that does don't touch it oh he does I hate when zombies in video games or movies have like strangely varying uh, like levels of intellect. I hate that. Just make them smart or make them stupid. Don't make some really dumb and others capable of complex tasks like levers and shit. Maybe I'm just picking nits. I'll take that. Don't go in the water. That is now properly dangerous. Okay. Here we go. Oh my, there's a lot of you. No, that's not what I wanted. Shit. Surprise, motherfucker. Oof. Whoa! What the hell was that? I thought somebody just accidentally lifted the... Oh, no. This is a bad idea. I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm going to set the dude with the dynamite on fire. Sebastian, have you ever visited something called school? Let's go ahead and use this. Damn it. No. You can't punch wildly at things. That's my job. Uh-oh. Gah! Oof. I don't like it when they just... drop. Damn it. Oh. Now nah, let's uh let's use this. Didn't, uh, didn't see the ladder? Oh, that one had an explosive anus. Should I be able to pick those up? Or maybe I have to set him on fire, which will make those go off, which will blow a hole in the... I'm overthinking this. This door probably just opens. No?
Damn it! Oh. Wow, that sucked. Nope. We will keep going. Which, <laughs> despite the fact that I'm sucking right now, we're gonna keep going. That's... That's my 50th episode spectacular. We're gonna... <laughs> we're gonna push forward. I really would like to be able to pick up that dynamite. That would be ever so swell. I guess I have to just deplete their forces from up there. No, fuck off. Damn it. Oh shit. you off the edge. Nah, I'm just gonna have to give you the old yellow treatment. Boom! Oh, that was dark. Oh god, I shot him in the dick. I'm sorry. No man or monster deserves that. Oh, he's so pissed now. I did it again! God, I'm so sorry. Well, that's what it was. I'm a monster. What's that saying when, when looking for revenge, first dig two graves? That worked well. Wait, light it, and then eh. Out of ammo. Shit. No, it didn't work. Okay. 
Yeah, there's a lot to do. Come on. This is good. This is going well. Wait, stop shooting at me while I trip balls. Oh, hey, man. I didn't realize you were, uh... I didn't realize anybody was watching. Welcome to, uh... Our 50th episode spectacular! Woo! This is actually our 50th... <laughs> you wanna know this? what special thing I've done for our 50th episode spectacular? Uh, that, that was it. No! Get that shit away from me! all of my skill and judgment. Ready? Open. And open. And open. And open. What the hell, man? Damn it! Come on! <laughs> This went from Resident Evil to Die Hard in like 10 minutes. Okay. There's ammo there. I can use the sniper rifle. What is with me and shooting guys in the dick? I... Mm, this is... I should really talk to somebody about this. See if there's some sort of past trauma that leads me to... Just destroying zombie phalluses. With bullets. Uh, careful. Good. At least we can do something right. <laughs> I didn't trip. I'm falling with style. A uh, little, little brain juice. This has another place where I have to fight dudes written all over it. So let's let's get everything we can first. Good, good. I'd like at least one more magnum bullet before I go dirty hairy on somebody again. 
I got a little overzealous with that. Alright. Hmm, I'm not gonna mess with that. Do I... Do I... Eh, good. Just give me one of those guns! Please! I'll be really careful. I'll, f I'll, I'll walk it, I'll feed it every day. Just... Just let me have it. Everyone. Well, well, there we go. Oh, I need that so bad. Okay. <sighs> Shizzle! Shizzle! I could be doing anything right now. I could be reading a book. I could, I could be doing all kinds of shit. But no, here I am. Nuzzled up against a column. Getting shot at by some guy in a weird mask. Quickly! Whoosh! And before it disappears, just give me it! It's right there! Come. No! Oh, God, that's like getting kicked in the balls. Just watching it disappear. God damn it. All right, now, where's the other one? I know there were two. Fire, fire, good. I'm just gonna watch it go, goodbye. <sighs> Junk Shredder. Oh yeah, I've only named one gun. This is uh, my trusty handgun I've named Exhibit A. Because I... I cap so many fools with it. But Junk Shredder, <laughs> that's pretty fucking funny. What's happening? What's going on? Okay. Well, this is an obvious trap, but I want all of this. F I want these swell prizes. Oh, no. What have I done? Uh, mm, no. 
Get out of here! Shit! No! Oh. Doesn't really work if they suck. Okay, that wasn't really the dick, but it was... It was close. I just got overwhelmed, man. Nothing I could do. <laughs> oh, man. I see an episode ending level of frustration during this sequence. Fiftieth episode spectacular. Bring it on. gonna focus on these guys. Good, good. This is manageable. I'm super concentrating right now. Fuck! 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 Good, good, good. Is that a dude I have to worry about? Nah, just, just keep moving. Oh no. Oh, one wrong move and you're toast. No pun intended. Alright, it's getting late. I'm gonna try this one more time. I was... <laughs> I was hoping that just by saying I'll try this one more time, that's just like, setting myself up for victory. Jet Li and I have only uh, one thing in common, and that this is the one. Scanning. Scanning for targets. Beep boop pop. Thank you. Although I can't help but feel that was a uh, conciliatory, you can do it! What do you got there? He's not close enough to the edge. What do I do? Boom! Running, 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 running. Look out for fire.
Can't hit me, I'm like the Flash. Eh. Actually, I've got more of a Flash Gordon thing going on. Okay. Oh, bollocks. My, uh... <laughs> my computer has run out of battery. Wait, I might be able to... Hmm. Whatever! My computer's out of battery, I can't watch the, uh, the chat anymore, and for some reason it's not working on the other thing. So, sorry, Freddy. I'm going it alone. Wait, I know that music. No, that's the uh, that's the music. What sends me off to that special place? Don't look down. Don't look at the water. There's things in the water. You don't want any part of that. Okay. Brain energy. There's so much like brain and sticking things in brain imagery in this game. I. I am so positive that, uh, I, you know, again, Shutter Island spoilers in 3, 2, 1, but, uh, I'm, I'm positive that, like, there was the information that Castellanos, like, lost his wife and kids, and, like, he, he started investigating a, uh, like, the Beacon Hill Asylum. I think, not only did, was he plugged into the thingamajig, at the asylum, I think, I think that he was actually an inmate of the asylum before all this shiz went down. I think that, like, the first level, like, even from the first level onwards, that, uh, he was in the thing. Because, oh, shit, because the Ruvik guy, like, when we were watching him on the monitor, he still had, like, the teleporty powers. But now we know that the teleporty power is like, he's only like super powered dude because like it's his world, because it's in his mind. So even from the beginning of the game, I think we were always in his mind. Shit, we're not, we're an inmate. Oh, <laughs> all right, I'm going to read this and then I'm going to save and I think that'll be it for now. Almost six months since the accident, <clears throat> Myra and I drift further apart with every passing week. I have to stay strong, but it's so easy to drown my thoughts in whiskey. I figure as long as it doesn't affect my work, what I do on my own time is private. I finally got Myra to open up to me about the accident. Now I'm more worried than ever. I don't know what's worse, the fact that Myra is becoming paranoid than, and maybe losing her mind, or the fact that what she's proposing... That the fire wasn't an accident could be real. I owe it to her to trust her instincts. But if they're correct, God help whoever did this. Dun, dun, dun. Any other goodies in here I can pick up? No. Ah, God. I wonder if there's an upgrade that gives me some fucking sunglasses. That's oppressive. Back here. Must be losing it. <sighs> and there's still shit all over the ground. Feeling better. All right. Now. We we talked about this. There's still shit all over the ground. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to let you go. <laughs> She's like, let me go. She goes. Bleh, bleh. Starts growing arms and faces and shit. I'm like, yeah, okay, no, fine. Secretary's fine. Secretary's good. It's good. All right. Well, that was an action-packed, die-hardy episode of The Evil Within. Uh, we got way more accomplished than uh, the previous chapter. And uh, 
Thank you guys for watching. I know you are all probably saying very insightful, clever things in the chat right now that I can't watch. But, uh, but seriously, thanks you, thank you guys for watching. I mean, I'm, I'm assuming, uh, on YouTube, our 50th episode. Uh, you guys are, uh, you guys are the best. I will see you next time.